right? So uh, this computer diagnostic kit, we say it is very powerful because it is capable of troubleshooting both laptop and desktop computers, right? And actually, it also troubleshoot any machines with standard USB port. So this time, I get a Mac laptop. Mac laptops, it also comes with a standard USB port. So I would like to see it how how good it works. Okay. So to start with, let's get the all right. Let's get the part out to do the USB diagnosis. We need this cable. We need a master board. Okay. Only these two parts we need. Okay. First, we need to install. Uh, let's see the app, latest apps. Make sure we connect it to the internet, Wi-Fi, and then we visit a website called. Okay, and it will lead us to the. Uh, Amazon Cloud Drive. Then we open this folder, and in the folder, there's two files. One is the PDF with all the you know desktop, laptop, computer wirings, and then comprehensive user guides. Okay, and then the first one, which is the latest uh, 7.1 Android apps, and we need to download this to our computers. I mean, to our to our Android phone first. It takes about uh, four point seven five, about five megabyte space. Okay, and we can check out the status. The network here is probably yeah. So we need to wait a little bit. Okay, while we are downloading, right? We can first pair the Android phone to the master diagnostic card. So we need to plug in the USB cable. Well, this USB cable is built-in cable on the master board, so this is for supplying power to the Android. Uh, I mean the Bluetooth module. Okay, so use Android charger, five volt charger, and then we we'll see the blue, blue light flashing, right? Okay, and then we go to our Android phone. Go to the setting. Make sure the Bluetooth. Pay a new device, then we look for the one ending BT10. Let's see which one is that. Okay, all right. So we see the QI GUAN BT10, right? Click it, and then the password is either four zeros or one two three four. I test it myself, so one two three four is working. So and leave the two check box and check. Click on OK. And we it will okay pair okay pretty quick okay, and now we need to do is go back to our download okay download file open it okay install it okay if the screen asks you to give the right just say okay enjoy system it will automatically check for the security you know so once it passes the security it will. Which this screen install and then ask us to you know to do the next okay so then done click on done okay and then we we see the app is installed here now we need to do the app level application level we need to tell our app to link to to work to link to this master board first so you know what to do next. So we turn on the apps. Whatever we see at the front screen, just click on the bottom. I already know that. No, and then next we click on upper. This is the main men menu. Okay, this is the dian diagnosis app main menu. Remember, the top it says please follow the steps below. Right, we already done most of them. Okay, so next we will do is click on the upper right. See upper right here, and then and then the click below, uh, BT10 module. Okay, and then watch out the top. See it updated connected to the diagnostic card, correct? So at this time, this app already sees this master board, master diagnostic board. So next, we will do the diagnosis. All right. So 
we need we will connect the USB wire between to connect the master diagnostic board to the Mac laptop. Okay, all right. So make sure we use the small connector micro USB and then connect it right. Okay, just connect it a bit. Okay, make sure that and then the, the other end, the other end of this cable. Okay, let's get it straight first. We connect to our laptop, main laptop, okay? So just make sure the top status is connected to the diagnostic card. Make sure the status is is correct, okay? And then now we turn on the laptop. Okay, and see, press the power button. See, the testing is in progress. And we will wait until the pro oh Whoa, it's so so fast, so quick. The USB test pass, USB CPU, motherboard memory and USB controller. See see the flashing light? Flashing light on the master diagnostic board. It means uh, the USB diagnostic data is transferring. So this time it shows us uh, the whole laptop is working. USB test pass, CPU, motherboard memory and USB controller all working. Okay, and then see, yeah, it is it is working. So uh, maybe we have other machines with standard USB port, you know. So next time you can try it on yourself. So any kind of machines, <laughs> maybe in, even including the cashier machines. Okay, all right. I uh, hope this video helps. Any question, you know, uh, contact me and I would like to help as soon as I can. All right, thanks for watching. This is William again.